Hi there. In this Sage Business Cloud Accounting video, we'll quickly look at how we can add departments, allocate um, line items and transactions to them, and then view the uh, profit and loss statement and filter it by those departments. <coughs> Just going to go back to my application here. And settings. And analysis types. I'll use uh, transactions, transaction analysis, department, and I'll quickly add some departments. So this is uh, a furniture store. I want to say we have sales. We have design, design rooms and whatnot. And we also have installation repair because we do sell appliances. And I'll choose sales invoices and bills. Again, that'll apply to profit and loss reports. And I'll save. Then I'll quickly sell something. New invoice to Dixon on February 11th. And there we're selling them a 105. And these three dots will allow me to allocate it. That's two sales. Also a 101. Again, I'll allocate that to sales. And also some service. Where's my service item? Ah, oh, there it is. Installation. And we're going to allocate that to service. Actually, we'll allocate that to design. And I'll go ahead and post that. Now we can actually an analyze our profits, profit and loss report by filtering by the departments. So if I go to profit and loss standard, and I'll look at uh, February up to the 11th. And notice that we have a more analysis type department. And then we can filter by one of our departments. So I'll take a look at this uh, installation repair. So we have no installation or repair. Take a look at design. There's our design revenue and sales. There's our sales revenue. So again, that's uh, adding departments, uh, allocating them to line items on an invoice, and then filtering the profit and loss report to show particular departments. Thanks so much for watching.